anticipation building, the one and two Blackwell Hornets and the two and one Robert Lee Steers are eagerly gearing up for their Friday night showdown. Visiting a rematch of last season, the saw the Steers claim a 46-38 victory. The Hornets enter this next matchup with unwavering determination to rectify their past mistakes. It's going to have to do more things right and not have as many turnovers for one thing. I think we had five or six last week and we got to cut that down. And, you know, hopefully we can hang in there and make them work a little bit and give them a good game. With several losses to graduation, the Hornets now have a youthful team eager to embrace learning and continuous growth each week. Uh, everyone's been feeling in pretty good, stepping up. All the lower kids, they, they've been doing really good. I'm really impressed with them. They're out there underneath the fire and uh, we've got two kids that's got a lot of varsity experience and the rest of them haven't. And I said, you're having to learn the hard way. With a second year head coach at the helm for the Steers and the return of 10 experienced players, they aspire to build upon their early season success. I mean, we know, know each other. Uh, I know what players can do. They know what they can do. Uh, some of them are surprising us and, and doing more than what we thought, and that's a, that's a positive thing. Uh, so we're just continuing doing what we do. The athletes are geared up for on-field improvement and have an understanding of what it takes to secure a victory. We need to be more physical and aggressive, honestly, because we're not the biggest team, but we need to be more aggressive on the defensive side of the ball. We're going to treat them as a, a great opponent, come out there, do our, uh, our jobs great, and be good.